The leadership of Agbado Kyodo Local Council Development Area called on stakeholders in the council to deliberate on the areas of priority in project execution. The stakeholders and leaders of various associations in the local government converged to present their requests. I believe we have a very good plan already. If we can put or articulate all our views on those forms, and I know the appropriate committee of the efficiency of this local government, we look at those projects efficiently and make sure it is incorporated inside our coming budget. I believe we can have what we call guide them young from primary school. In fact, this can also serve as a, uh, as a means of uh, any to the local government. If the government can help us with little, little agriculture in different primary schools, those that have the space. I want our uh, local government to pay attention to us, specifically this time around. There must be a budget drop control in our local government. Everywhere you go, every area that you visit, our youth needs help. At the meeting, the chairman, Honorable David Famuyiwa, enumerated some of the achievements of the present administration and expressed readiness to execute more projects in line with the needs of the people in the coming year. Famuyiwa added that 80% of the executed projects are the community requests at the 2024 Budget Stakeholders Forum and the achievements could not have come to reality without the support and cooperation of members of the executive committee, legislators, management team, staff, and the great people of Agbado Okeodo, LCDA. No, it's not to word, it is not worthy to state that 80% of this executive project mentioned above are the product of your request at the 2024 budget stakeholder forum. I wish to seek your continued support Cooperation, understanding, and prayer as we work toward making a Wadu Kyodo. A Wadu Kyodo SCDA Council, a place we can, we can all be proud of. The Supervisor for Budget, Planning, Research, and Statistics, Bemileke Adeyemi, appealed to the community members present at the stakeholders' meeting to be more committed financially, morally, and collaboratively with the present government. For, gov for government, or our government to be able to carry out all what they submitted here today. They have to be supportive in terms of paying their levies, paying their, you know, the rate that they accrue to the local government from their jobs, from their programs, and what they do every year. The stakeholders present at the meeting expressed delight over the all-inclusive governance of the present administration. We are expecting uh, more projects, more developments, more uh, visits by the chairman so that he can even go down and see us. So that by seeing us, we be continue to tell him what we need. My expectation is that he should continue to do what he's doing and do more. He should keep it up. He's trying his best. By the next question. year, we you, expect an improvement you want, over like this year's uh, performance. This year's budget is about 80% you want to performance. You next year, we don't, expect don't, 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 almost 100%. I know we can't get 100% because most of the funds we have to source for it, but then we expect a better performance than this year. As a result of this meeting, there is hope that people-oriented projects will be executed in 2025. It's very encouraging. Even though our revenues improve very well, the ratio of uh, the last year compared to the last year, this year is very, very impressive, especially our internally generated revenue. So all these things cannot be done if they don't pay their uh, levies and rates because we cannot uh, the, the allocation from the federal cannot be enough to do the, their request. They have to make sure that they assist us in paying their rent, I mean, uh, their rent, and, uh, and they pay their rent and levels.